Whoa, good morning everybody. It's the 6th of August today and a lovely morning it is too, though we are forecast heavy showers later on today. Um, and last night we were harvesting till, well, gone dark, trying to get the oilseed rape finished. And this is what's in the shed at the minute. We haven't grown anywhere near as much as we have done in the past uh, for various reasons. One is to do with the near nicotinoid ban, which means we can't use it on the seed dressing and we had to re-drill about 200 acres and we put wheat in in place of the rape that failed but what I'm going to do is just come through into the other bay and just to have a look on top of the heap you might be able to hear in the background some wind noise and that's because last night I left the fan blowing air through this heap when I looked last night this heap of rape was I think it was 31 degrees centigrade and it's always a good job to get get it cooled down as much as possible and let's just see what it's got down to overnight I'll turn that on there we are and if you look on the floor down here you think there's lots of oil seed rape scattered down here when in fact you'd be wrong these are all beetles uh -huh. This is the last load from last night just coming in. I think it's only about quarter full. And the temperature now of the heat is exactly 20 degrees centigrade. So I've knocked 10 degrees centigrade out of that, which makes it much cooler. And I'll wait for another night when it gets down to single figures. And I'll get the, uh, the whole heat down to below 10 degrees centigrade if that's still possible. This is the difficult part with these old sheds. When they were built, there was plenty of room, but now this modern machinery is just so big, he finds it so difficult to back in here and can't tip the trailer very high at all. So he's tipped as, dare, as high as he dare go. Now he's going a little bit more. But the rape is so dry, this is about 6% moisture content, and when he opens his back door, it runs out. Good job as well, if it was damp it wouldn't run out. Now the problem is getting all of it out. What he will do in fact is shut his door, put it down, go outside, tip it right up and get all the rape up against his back door. And there's a heap of rape. And that's done for this little video.